welcome the official Chamber Color Guard, the Army JROTC from Everglades High School for the presentation of colors and the singing of the national anthem by Hervina Bastian. stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rockets red glare the bombs bursting in air gave proof through the that our flag was still there. Oh, say does that star-spangled banner yet wave o'er the lands of the free and the It is indeed a beautiful day to become crazy about Crazy Vegan. So if you're not vegan, no worries, they got you because the taste is phenomenal. So we're ready to go ahead and kick this art. So Mark Leviskin, our chair of our board, and on behalf of the Miramar Pembroke Pines Regional Chamber of Commerce, our members and our board of directors and our beautiful city of Miramar, this is the day to open Crazy Vegan, so we're very excited. So, Chair of the Board, Mark Leviskin, take this away, sir. Thank you, Patty. Pat wow, what a crowd. A lot of, lot of chamber members here, and there's a lot of new faces here. But before I, we go into the ceremony, I just want to welcome you to the chamber. I know you've been to the, you were to breakfast last time, but for the people that don't know about this chamber, the Miramar Pember Pines Chamber of Commerce, Last year was a great year for us. We were voted the Chamber of the Year in Florida. But one thing that we're really proud of, and I know most of you have heard of it, but some of the people haven't, we have been voted, we earned a four-star accreditation by the U.S. Chamber of Commerce. Less than 3% of the Chamber of Commerce in the United States do get that. So this is the chamber that you belong to. It's a great chamber. It's active. You know what I say all the time to new members? I said, you get what you put into it. As you can see, last time we had our breakfast, there's a lot of people there. It was most we've had in for forever. So before we go into the ceremony, I want to introduce one of my board members. Uh, good afternoon, Michael Ross, Harlan Payroll. All right, to kick it off. From the great city of Miramar, Mayor Messam. Thank you, Mark. Good morning, everyone. How's everyone doing today? No, you're supposed to say you're feeling crazy. So how are we doing today? That's right, that's right. So on behalf of the city of Miramar and on the chamber, uh, we're really happy and excited about Crazy Vegan opening up its newest location right here in the city of Miramar. 
We know when you're a business and you're expanding and opening up, there's so many red tape and regulations and restaurants, you're checking a lot of boxes with a lot, not just the city of Miramar, but the state and everything. So to be able to have two locations just shows that not only that your food is great, but you have wonderful business professionals that is growing a brand, a brand that is full of health. And um, when you think about members of the chamber, we have to support each other. You know, some of you are realtors, finance folks, you got clients out here. Come over here and meet them for lunch, you know, to support the business. And the business will take care of you when you come. So each one teaches one and each one scratches each other's back. So that's what it's all about. You really get in, you really get out of the chamber what you put into it. So I would like to um, introduce my fellow members of the commission, as well as um, one of our staff members that are here to celebrate and recognize this day for Crazy Vegan. And first we'll have um, our Vice Mayor Alexandra Davis, followed by Commissioner Chambers. Thank you so much. It's a great day once again in the city of Miramar. There's been, I guess, two ribbon cuttings this week. Um, we're doing very well. And we're so pleased to have the crazy vegan here in our city. I'd like to invite them. Hopefully, they come out to festivals. I'm not sure they do. Oh, good. Because we have the Afro Korean Festival right here in the city, February 17th. And we want to make sure people can taste the different flavors of the diaspora. And so, this will be a great addition to that event. But I'm so glad you're here. We wish you all the success. And I'm looking forward to trying out some of the vegan dishes that you have here. I'm a pork eater. So, you know, this is the other extreme. <laughs> but I, I'm willing to try something new. Thank you so much. Uh, now we have our Commissioner Maxwell Chambers. Thank you so much, Vice Mayor. My second ribbon cutting for this morning. Um, the first thing I noticed when I got here well, the price, prices, it's good. Last year I had my daughter here. She'd been a vegan for over 10 years. And we went somewhere and it's almost burnt a hole in my pocket. So this time when she come back, I got someplace close, someplace clean, beautiful, good people. And she's going to be very happy. She's going to be like, Daddy, I'm going to be the best dad in the world when she comes back. All right? <laughs> you know, I just want to say thanks to the business owner. He could have gone somewhere else, but it's chose to be right here in Miramar, especially over here on the west side of Miramar, where this kind of food is so, so needed. I want to thank you, my brother. Thank you so much. And I'm sure all the residents out there will really support and appreciate it. Vegan burger right here in West Miramar. Thank you and God bless. I did want to quickly recognize Johnny Douglas. If you just raise, raise your hand, Johnny is a very active with the chamber, is on the front lines with our businesses, and our professionals like Johnny is really what makes it work, being able to get out into the community and work with our businesses. So if you have ever have an issue, feel free to call myself, the vice mayor, the commissioner, Johnny, if there's ever an issue, you know we're just a phone call away to try to, to address it. So much success and congratulations. No, no, it's a, no, not a big deal. Um, Good morning, all, and uh, it's an absolute pleasure to welcome you to our city. It truly is. My name is Jose Gregorish. I'm the fire marshal for the city of Miramar. Some of that red tape that the mayor was referring to, some of the permitting pain that he was referring to is uh, is caused by a, a necessary evil. But uh, uh, jo Joyce Lynn reached out, and I'll let her speak on that a little bit more. Um, you know, clearly our interest is in the partnership of ensuring that those businesses come in and thrive. And so I promised her early on that uh, oftentimes it's just a matter of sitting down, coming to the table and figuring out what the needs are. And we, we made it all work together. We made it we made it happen. And as promised, here we are celebrating. I, I, I promised you we'd look back on this day and, and, and go, you won't even you won't even remember any of that stuff. It'll be un unimportant. And so welcome. It is an absolute pleasure. I am a resident here. I will be visiting often. Welcome. Welcome to the beautiful city of Miramar. It's a pleasure to have you here. All right, you ready? All right. You're up the back. Uh, good morning, everyone. Um, I recognize that there are many things you could do this morning, and you came out to support the Crazy Vegan. So thank you all very, very much um, for the fellow chamber members we've just joined. Thank you, Patty, for making this so easy for us and arranging this, this wonderful event. 
and uh, the mayor and his team. Yes, the mayor was on speed dial on my cell phone. I did reach out to him. Um, anyway, uh, so thank you all very much. Uh, we're really happy that we're here in the city of Miramar, but I would be remiss without acknowledging members of the team that actually made this happen. So uh, many of you may or may not know that we are a family business, um, and when you choose your family, those people are even more special. So some of us are connected by blood, some of us aren't. So I'm going to take a few minutes just to introduce the people that actually made the Crazy Vegan happen. So we all have different areas of specialty and we all play to those areas of specialty. So um, my partner and um, partner in crime, who we work, we work together every day, usually starting from four or five o'clock in the morning, uh, is Alex. He's the founder and I'm going to give the, the mic to him in a few minutes, founder and my partner. Um, and he was the one that actually came up with the idea of the Crazy Vegan and brought us all to the table. Um, my son, who's the executive chef, his name's Reese Ellis. Um, he's the one that actually comes up with all the recipes um, that you're going to be trying. Um, my nephew, Isaiah Chisholm, he has just come back from the military so um, and has been a needed addition to our team. Um, my cousin right there, Stephen Edwards, uh, he actually lives in Philadelphia. He's a partner and has also made this dream come alive. And my husband, Kevin Ellis, <laughs> and my husband, Kevin Ellis, um, who is not here today. Um, I also want to recognize some of our employees who went back in to start cooking your food. So we have O'Neill Ford, who's one of our chefs, and Deandra Duhaney Brooks. There are a number of other individuals that actually helped to make this happen. Like I said, we have two locations here in Miramar as our second and in Hallandale. Um, but again, before I close and pass the mic to Alex, I want to thank you all. Um, yes, the red tape was incredibly painful, but I made some really great friends, um, but we made it happen. And I do appreciate that it is for the safety of the citizens of Miramar and Pembroke Pines. So I recognize it's not personal, although it did feel like it at the time. <laughs> All right, so without further ado, I'm going to give the mic to Alex. Good morning. How are you doing? Yeah. Y'all ready for some crazy food? All right, so check it out. I'm not going to talk forever because I talk for a living, so I don't want to just sit here and just keep running my mouth. But just uh, in harmony with what Joyce was saying, I want to thank uh, the mayor and um, this, the city of Miramar. And something that he said to me that I really need to take heed to, and it's just to test take heed to, and it's just a testament of um, the Chamber of Commerce and just the city of Miramar. I called them late one night. He'd tell you I was frustrated. I was like, man, no, so man, I need, I'm having these issues. And he was like, and I, I just felt bad. I felt really, really bad about calling them. He says, Alex. We have a relationship, and you have to leverage your relationships to sometimes to get things to happen. And look at what's out here today. It's because we leveraged those relationships. We were able to get open because of relationships. So I want to say thank you to the chamber, first and foremost. Thank you to Mayor Messam and your whole crew, because y'all really helped me, Gabby. And also, Jose, thank you so much, all right? Appreciate it. Now to the food. Here's what we want to talk about now, all right? So it's been a journey for the last uh, couple of years with the Crazy Vegan. We're so happy to be here in the city of Miramar. And just to give you a little brief history uh, about me, um, I do afternoons at Hot 105. I've been here for um, the last couple of decades. And I took a kind of step back away from me because of health issues. But the thing is, from being from Philly, I miss my cheesesteaks, my cheeseburgers, and all the rest of the fat stuff, okay? So... So listen, and nobody ain't gonna lose no weight coming here, okay? I'm just gonna be honest with you, all right? But it's a healthier, it's a healthier option, okay? It's a much healthier option to what you are eating. And the biggest thing, I think the success of the Crazy Vegan is because people that are willing to try it, because I would probably say half of our customers are not even vegan, they just enjoy the food. So we welcome you, thank you for your support, take pictures, go to Instagram, tell your friends, do everything you need to do. We're here to support you and everybody that's a member of the chamber, forever you get 10% off at the Crazy Vegan, okay? And now I'm telling y'all cousins all the rest of that stuff, okay? It's for y'all, all right? I mean, come with you and you can get it, you know, it's all right, but you know, that's what it is, all right? So thanks again, thank you guys for coming out and welcome to the Crazy Vegan. All right, okay. Oh, you guys, well, and one more thing, um, our grand opening is also tomorrow, so if you didn't get a chance to, uh, you can't stick around and you can't get any food, the grand opening is tomorrow. Um, and when you get your food, always remember when you order, you know, it may take a few minutes longer only because we make our food fresh. We don't pre-cook any food, everything is fresh, and you'll be able to taste the difference and you'll taste the love, okay? All right, there you go.
You sure now? Yeah, I'm sure, I'm positive. All right, you got All it, right. man. All right, here we go. All right. What we're going to do is we're going to take a photo off first, so do not do not cut yet. Anybody else you want to hold the uh, scissors? You want to go in there? Hands in. Hands in. All right. So the first what we're going to do is we're going to do a photo op. So three, two, one, take a picture. All right. Here we go. Now we count down from five. Four. Four. Three. three two, two. One. Ah! Hey! Okay, if I can have a couple of people come over here, or everybody that wants to come over here, if the floor is not too far, there's a little step right here that you can sit, so we can all have a nice picture with Crazy oh, Vegan. Come on over. Thank you. And we also have our frame from the Chamber of Commerce. That means you can never, ever leave us. <laughs> come on over, come on over. Okay, you guys ready? Okay, repeat after me like the mayor said. Let's say one, two, three, crazy! More enthusiasm, please. One, two, three. Crazy! Okay, now you're really excited. And we're gonna throw our hands up, like we're gonna get crazy vegan burgers coming from the sky, and we're gonna say, crazy! Welcome to the city of Miramar, and for the Chamber family.